Hi, good morning, everyone. You ever had one of those experiences where you feel like you got the raw end of the deal, where it didn't turn out the way you wanted it to? In fact, you felt cheated. Um, somebody got the better of you that uh, is totally uh, in the wrong and should have never happened. And you feel like, man, that's not fair. It, um, it should never have gone that way. Well, the Bible is really uh, amazing because God understands that there are things in this world that aren't fair, that they don't go the way that he planned them to go, the way he designed them to go. And it, it affects us. And it's a bummer. He, he tells us this, though. He says, be of good cheer. Isn't that great? Be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. So these systems that feel like they're oppressing you, that are taking advantage of you, that are doing things to you that should never be done. He says, take cheer, I have overcome that. There is a day that we're going to see the righteousness of God played out in every circumstance. Everything that was unfair, everything that was mistreated, everything that was done poorly, all those things, we will see the righteousness of God because Jesus has won, he's overcome. It's a promise, we can bank on it, we can hold on to it. I want you to hold on to that today. Well, whatever thing you're going through, say, Lord, you've already defeated this, you've overcome it, and I just can't wait to see the victory. Jesus, thank you for that victory. Thank you for that promise. I pray that we would cling to it today, hold on to you today with all of our heart, with all of our soul, with all of our strength. Love you, God and see the victory that you have won. In Jesus' name, amen. Let's walk out that victory today. Let's hold on to it. Sure love you guys. Look forward to being with you tomorrow.